Hey guys, Brenda here. Welcome back to House of Off for part number 31, I think we're up to. Um, this episode, I have brought the home and car uh, plot of land. Um, so the car and stuff. Well, I would say it's usually in here, but um, I've sold the car and painted all the walls white, tidied everything up, and then inside the home, I've knocked down every single wall and um, made it so it's just a blank canvas for us to start with. Now, um, cat, well, whatever that is, cat seridophobia. Okay, let's um, get rid of these. I thought, I don't know why they're still here. I would have cleaned them up before, but anyway, get rid of all of those. Get rid of all these guys. I don't know if people have. I've never heard of anybody who has a legitimate fear of cockroaches, but anyway. Um, so this episode, I was going to go for a complete build um, of us doing whatever we want to do. There's something I've missed tidying up. Where is it gone? There it is. Um, and Casey Wayman has asked for us to do a Chelsea football club theme. So um, that was an idea that I had that we could do. So... Um, uh, what are we going to do here? I was thinking of doing like a bedroom here and a bedroom here, but there's not a great deal of room, is there? I mean, I think that should be okay. Like a bedroom slash bathroom. Let's have a look. So what? One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Let's go there. So if we go from there out. Turn this into a bedroom. And then turn us this way. We're obviously going to need to knock out the wall to put in a door there. Um, so this could be maybe the kitchen. The bedroom here, and then maybe the bathroom next to it. To like kitchen, lounge, uh, kitchen, lounge room. Um, we've been kitchen and then dining and then lounge room or something and then a bedroom here. Um, do we want it that wide though? I don't really know. Definitely want to leave a gap to there. There we go. There we go. Put another one in here. Come on. There we go then along this way, which will match with that other wall. Perfect. So we'll walk in straight into like, the lounge room. Well, we could always have... Actually, we need a bathroom here too, don't we? That's another thing that we need. Um, but we need to work on the bedrooms first, I think. So let's go with a hammer. Um... One, two, three, four. Start here. Two, three. That's kind of the center, isn't it? So we need to either be back or forward. Let's go back one. Uh, two, three, about here. Smack those ones. Hurry up and fall down. There we go. Still waiting. There we go. Alright, so bedroom one, bedroom two, which will be the parents' room. That's why it's a little bit bigger. And then, um, the little boys' room, I guess, which was um, my idea for Chelsea. So. What I want to do now is go into paint. Paint, go blue. Um, that's probably as close as you're going to get to the Chelsea colour. It's probably not ideal though, is it? We don't even need white because all the walls are already white. So go two, go gap. 
One gap blue. Go two gap one gap and then blue. Do the sort of stripes like you have on the top of their jersey sort of thing. I think we just paint all the other ones blue. Maybe even match uh, match this wall. Let's go say so two gap gap go two the gap gap and there beautiful um, that's one we're supposed to leave okay there we go so they'll kind of match I mean I know it's not that wall looks really weird uh, so both of those get him out of the way. Kind of does look really weird, doesn't it? So as far as the bedroom goes, um, bedding blue is not the right blue, which is the only problem. Uh, navy, how's that? That's much much better. But I think um, light nut, alcander, oak. Let's go go with the light nut. I think. Beautiful. There we go, how cool is that? Um, cupboards. Ah, where are we? Uh, Mal. Go to beach. Can we get it in here? Um, okay. I kind of just wanted that so we can go home electronics, put in a monitor. Monitor HD? No, we can put in this one. There we go. So you can watch his favourite footy plays in bed, I guess. Um, we want to go with a desk. Definitely want a desk for him. Uh, beach, I'm sure, will be fine to match everything else. across a couple. Maybe about there. If I go into others first, try and fit in a bin beside it. Probably could do it this way anyway. Put a bin in there. Now I want to try something which um I've been told to try before and haven't done it as yet. So put this here. Um, What I want to do is, I think we can stack on top of there, can't we? We can, but we can't stack on top of the red books, I don't think. No, we can't, okay. That, another classic book, doesn't want to go on top of there, which is a panel, oh, there we go. Here, there, and everywhere. Doesn't really matter where they go. Or the name of the book, I don't really care to be honest. Right, one more book on here. Now I go, I sell. And they kind of just fall all over the place, but it didn't really fall <laughs> not where I wanted them to, I guess. Now let's go to lamp. In a desk lamp. That'll do. We'll go chair. Yeah, we'll go a navy blue swivel chair. I so said that's more the Chelsea colour than this wall, but that's probably about as good as we're going to get, I would say. Um, curtains, narrow, short. Blue. They're not the blue that we want either, which is a bloody pain. We'll just go white then. A 
Go. We'll go with um, blind. Put in a blind as well. Okay. So he's got that there. We're going to need some more cupboards. Beach. Beach and black. How does that look? That's not too bad. Let's go. Others. I'm gonna go soccer, but I think it's just class as a ball, isn't it? There we go. Put that there. Uh, dark blue laundry basket. Now we go into our gallery, which is probably gonna take a little while to load. But um, yeah, this was Casey Wayman's idea to do a Chelsea Football Club theme. Um, unfortunately, I said that we can't get the similar blue on these walls, which is a bit of a pain, but... Come on. It always takes forever loading this, this stuff in. <coughs> there we go. Uh, keep going. There's a few there that you can see. I want to have a look at this one. Um, this is the one I wanted to put up, but I probably should have put it up. It looks blurry as, so... I was trying to get like a full grandstand sort of thing, but I couldn't find one that wasn't blurry and that I was sure was the Chelsea Football Club. Like home... Home ground, I guess. Put this one in up into there. Put a few of these other ones scattered all over the place. Probably not quite that big. Maybe let's go 0.3 for these smaller ones. I don't know if these guys even play for Chelsea anymore, to be honest, because um, I'm not like a massive uh, soccer fan, so. I kind of hope they do. If not, then... Oh, well, I suppose. Oh, I really like this one. We will need to have this one as a bigger one. Okay. Um, haven't used these two yet. Oh, don't do that. like up above the TV and we haven't used this one either I don't think um, no, let's make it a little bit smaller I don't know about there somewhere I think that'll do. Doesn't look too bad. Room for Chelsea Football Club. Let's go into carpets. Nice blue carpet. There we go. It's got his soccer ball down there. Not a lot of stuff we can put up on here for him, I don't think. Not a knife. Uh, storage box. Put in any candles. Um, there's not much else that we can put in as a kit room, is there? I mean, like, we can put in Teddy Bear, which isn't too bad, I suppose. Kind of fits, doesn't it? There we go, that's pretty cool. Um, Not the blue we want, no. Normal bunny. Um, white box, got a blue box. I'll put that in there for toys and stuff. I'll go with a white one. There we go. 
Alright, let's go with doors. We need to put a door on, so I'm going to go with this internal white door. There we go. Um, now some lights. I'd really like to sort of showcase this picture as we walk in. So if we go... Um, thinking sconces with that, but then again, I'm not really sure. This is probably better, which I've used this one plenty of times, but go okay, installations, we'll go with a modern light switch. I'll have it down lower because obviously it's a little boys room, but I think it looks pretty good for a Chelsea football club room. Uh, let's see if we can get it all out of here. For our, whoop, I going to say for our screenshot. There you go. So that's the main build straight away, I guess. Um, we need to do like the parents' room. That's right, parents' room. Um, so I'm thinking bathroom. Where can we put in a bathroom? It's kind of a bit of a pain, isn't it? We could always... Um, Go through here and kind of cut into into here, couldn't we? I guess. Um, if we go installations, let's go shower plumbing. I'll go there. We need to undo these first. Um, bathroom. Shower. That will fit. Perfect. If we go bathtub, so we have to go installation bathtub. There, put in a bathtub there, I think. Done. Bathtub. Um. I was thinking like a sink here, and then we could probably put sinks down here. Maybe put the toilet on this side. Toilet plumbing. There we go. So, I think we need to knock the wall out, say, about here. Two, three, four. Let's assemble this, get it ready to go, and then see what it looks like. Hopefully we're um, right in the corner. I think we might be off the corner a little bit. Bastard. No. Oh. There we go. I think we definitely are. We're a little bit off the wall, but it's hard to judge. Sometimes you think you're right on the wall, but then it won't let you put it there anyway. So, oh well, we'll be off the wall a little bit. I think it's probably a good idea though to put the bathroom out here and just minimise the garage. So it is pretty long. There we go. So yeah, like a little tiny gap there, which sucks, but oh well, it is what it is. God damn it. Alright, I'm going to put the toilet on before we um, do anything else. Uh, let's go standard. I don't like the looks of the other ones. I want to go standard. Okay, hold the clean. So you want to come in here, get rid of that. Um, I'm thinking like the wall should be there, maybe. 
Is that going to be enough room though? That's the question. Come on, put it down. There you go. I think so. So what am I thinking? I was thinking like a double sink, but maybe not. Maybe we just put a sink up here. Um, I was going to try and put in, actually put in that there. Put in uh, a washer. There. All right, let's go uh, installations. No. Actually, yeah, we'll do that first. God damn it. Water everywhere. Uh, we'll go home appliances, washer. Take them out, not yet. Get out. Right, get our washer into place, and then we'll have a look at the sinks. I think uh, you. No, damn it! <laughs> Crazy. Literally, is there water over here? We've got now. I've got all the water. Okay, so I think. Um, Let's go installations. Um, where are we? Sink. I really don't know how far um, apart we need to put them. Let's go bathroom. Let's go installation sink. Try there. So we're going to be too far away, is it? Yes, it needs to come back. Uh, a couple. Let's try there. It's probably too close now. It's probably the one in the middle. Yes, yes, it is. Insulations. There. Now let's go sink. Beautiful. Let's try and get both sinks in without um, making any mistakes. Oop, really made a mistake already. That one, that one, that one. Oh, you bastard. <laughs> Considering how many of these I've put in, I'm still... Like, that was just clicking the wrong bloody thing. But I'm still surprised at how much we struggle. Uh, mirror. So I'd like to go... Double sideways, but... Know how good they sit beside each other, not very well. It works. Kind of looks a little bit odd, doesn't it? But, no, I think it'll work. Uh, let's go. Laundry basket, we'll go. Dark one, and we'll go like a natural one. Go to bathroom, don't forget our poo poo paper. There we go. So I'll walk in, let's go. Carpets. What are we going to do? What colour bathroom? Cyan or grey? We go like a grey bathroom. Yeah, it's not, I don't know, it's not that great a bathroom to be honest. 
but um, it'll work. We'll do what we need it to do. That's the main thing. Right, put these three in. That one. Bathroom. Let's go with um, some sconces. Got these ones, black and black. Perfect. Let's go with a door first before we work out where we're going to put. Yes, that's it. Where we're going to put our light switch. Heaps of light in here. Right, turn that off. Let's go. Um, curtains and blinds. We're going to go. Mantle narrow curtain. Have we got grey? Grey flowers. We need to make the short one, don't we? Because the bath is in the way. Okay, let's go with some closed curtains. Um, yeah, let's get some paint in here, I think. Um, steel grey. Is that even grey? So it kind of looks a little weird. It looks more of a grey than a brown. Alright, let's paint this whole wall down this side. Come on, there we go. Then we'll work out the tiles for the floor. make it look a lot better. That's probably a good start as well. Alright, oh, not you. Get rid of you. Let's go floor tiles. Um, I think just white. They're probably like the only ones that I would generally go with. Let's look at our wall tiles. I think we'll go with these ones. Just smack these on just around the shower. Which probably wouldn't look doesn't look too bad, I suppose. Okay. Right to there. The bathroom, nice and bright. It'll work. Everything we need in here, except for um, water heater, small. Put it there or put it here. There we go. Turn those lights off. So that's that done. Chelsea football room. Uh, which all the lights are staying on again because I think I've turned that off. Um, the bathroom, which is kind of hidden out of the way from the garage. Still enough room to get a little car in here, I suppose. Um, master bedroom now. Let's go with a bed sort by price descending, I should put. Hmm. Let's go this one. Go Venge, I'll make it dark. I'll make it roses. No, roses are it's disgusting. Blue stripes isn't too bad. Gold's not bad. We'll go gold. Come on, there we go. We'll go cupboards. Um, this one. How big do they look as like bedsides? Not bad, I suppose, as bedsides. Slash cupboards as well. 
Come on, there we go. So we definitely need plenty of storage in here. Um, go these ones, the big ones. There we go. I'm gonna put definitely gonna put a TV in the bedroom for the parents. Um, I think something, we need something here, like a shoe, the shoe cabinet, I guess. Ah, vengeance steel. We could probably put in a couple, actually. Put one there and one here. And the other idea would be to get other, um, basket get it in the middle perfect there we go that'll work all right now paints copper coin let's go copper coin and light cream we don't want to have any white walls that kind of doesn't really match the bed as much as I was hoping but Still pretty good. Okay. That doesn't change the colour of that wall much, but it does make a difference. There we go. Then we'll work out some blinds stuff as well. This is pretty much our first um, house build from the ground up with our own sort of interior layout and stuff, so it's not bad. Um, wide, short, why is that bloody pink? Gold flowers, I hope it's not pink in the game. Yeah, we'll go short, narrow. Same thing, gold flowers. Beautiful. So I don't think I'm going to worry too much about um, putting curtains and stuff in. Uh, put in these modern ones. These are the ones I'll, I love. These ones. You guys have probably already noticed that. Um. I don't think I'm going to go with any rug or anything in here. I don't think so. Let's go ceiling lamps. Let's go one there. One there somewhere. And then maybe one like here somewhere. Insulation without modern switch. There we go, plenty of light. Right, let's come out here. Now before we... Yes, let's get rid of you. We'll switch in there when we work out what we're going to do. So, I think we might do this side as the lounge room. Um, let's say so. That's kind of weird. I hate it how that's like that, but anyway. Cupboards. I'm gonna go with. Um, let's go with this one front. Um, let's go with the grey. Tabletop can go white. Okay, come on. There we go. I think I was gonna put the TV like here on this level. And turned a little bit. Go into our sofas. Um, let's 
So for Rodon or Redon, I don't know what the difference is there. Um, my thinking. Something like this, I guess. Want this one? Let's go with the black leather. I'm just gonna stick that there for now. Go with this one. Black leather. Because I wanted to kind of put this one at an angle. Something like that. Move this one back over. So there. So I can't really. I was going to try and put another one in here, but I don't think that's going to fit quite. Uh, let's go. Chairs. Let's put an old. Let's put an old rocking chair in here. No, it's going to look stupid. It's not. Um. Where are we? Where are we? Where are we? This one. That in there. Let's go with lamps. Put that in there. I think you can put one of these the other way, but down in there. Oh, it's not going to let us, is it? We can do it that way, but not the other way, which is weird. I don't know, but that'll work. Let's go home electronics. This bad boy down there. Standard loudspeaker. The mountain speaker. That one in here. I think that'll do. Just those three. And um, our DVD player can go Up there, and then we go. I don't really use many of these anymore, do we? Like the old, old ones that um, they've got us already in the game. So we'll just put that in. Um, don't do that. I hate it when it does that. No. There we go. Go others, let's go. Let's go red book and blue book. That'll do. So that doesn't look too bad. Let's go. Um, carpets. That doesn't look too bad. That'll work, I think. Let's go. Paints. Grey. This is like a little feature corner. There you go. Light on. That'll do. That's not bad. Alright, we'll come in here. I don't want to have a massive, massive kitchen. So, um, that's massive, though, isn't it? Yeah, that's not what I was thinking. Not really that one either. I know what I want to use, but. Great skin dark. Um, go there. Let's go cupboards. Great, great, great. Gives us a black top. Okay. Better if I had a white top, but 
it is what it is. Um, here's our appliances. I want to put in induction cooker there. Go, go back into uh, kitchen. Right, gray, gray, and gray. Nope, right, we've got to go all the way back. Thank you. Um, I'll put in a couple of these ones as well. One there, that one can go there because they've got different um, cupboards and stuff, so it's the main thing. You don't want all the same sort of style. Is there another one, or is that it? I thought there was another one single door, double door, and then that one. Oh, well, that's perfect. She might get rid of that one. That one there. Okay, home appliances put in out. Big um, double fridge as we usually do. And so we could have put like a dining table in here, but might still be an idea. This kind of looks empty over this side though, doesn't it? Um, let's go others. Look at that. I'm going to sit that under there. That's pretty cool. Well, that's probably... We know it's not ideal because... Ah, the way it opens. There you go. Rubbish bin there. We're going to put along there. Um... Gray, gray. Don't know if we really want like hanging cabinets or whatever across here. Ah, black and black. I'll kind of fill the spot in. I guess here we can put um, our microwave and our coffee machine. I know it's kind of out of the kitchen, but it's still, you know, kitchen utensils and stuff, so it'll work. Uh, put, say, the knife there. That can go there. A knife block will be here somewhere. Perfect. There we go. That'll kind of just help make it look like a proper kitchen. Oh, don't do that. That's so annoying. Don't do that, you bastard. Oh, okay. Teapot over there, I guess. I got this uh, grey. We probably don't want that there, do we? I don't know. We kind of want it there, but we can't because it is that too low. I don't think it's too low. That'll work. Um, this. That'll work along here. It's not gonna get burnt as such. Yeah, that'll do, I think. Well, let's go into our chairs. Um, we've really only got one bar chair, don't we? So, black with metal, okay. 
Put in a few along this side. Few along the front. I think that'll work. It doesn't look too bad. Just need to do our blinds and stuff. Our dining table, I think. I need to have it sort of go this way. Let's go somewhere like that. Look at what sort of chairs we're going to use. these ones color gray flowers there we go that'll work okay I'll move that table like as far forward as we can so like, when people actually come and visit we can move it back out why is it not like let's put it underneath it's kind of really strange, isn't it? All right, not that table then. Um, simple table. I think we just need something a little bit bigger than that, but that's too big. An oblong one, no. Um, table slim. I think that'll work. Uh, move it out a couple. There we go. Go back into our chairs. that'll work it doesn't look too bad actually so when we walk in we've got like a little dining area and we'll obviously we'll slide it out a little bit when we get extra people here TV and stuff over here kitchen over this side so it doesn't look too bad all right there we go put in some lights the kitchen we'll put in for the dining table One in for like the entryway, and we're going to need a couple for over here. Perfect. I think we probably need uh, something as we walk in the door. Let's go cupboards, which is usually this front white details white grey. Hmm. Can't put it there. We can put it here, but not a massive fan. Let's not even use that. Hmm. Let's go with these. Avenge. Probably not that one, this one. Put that one in there, and then maybe one over here as well. There, let's go to here. Put in a few candles, which I haven't used properly for a little while, I don't think. Let's see where else we can get one. There, that'll do. And plants. I can't remember the last time I actually put proper plants in anywhere. There we 
go. Um, so we did that with a red one. We go if we go into pictures and paintings. I don't. Why does it do it with some of them but not others? Really shits me up the wall, to be honest. Like that, there we go. Kind of just give us something for when we walk in. We really do need um, other paintings up on the wall, but. Come on. Something like that. Uh, what else have we got? Not really anything else suitable, I don't think. Well, that'll do. Well, that even. I know that's a game, but... Think? Is that a game? I think it's a game, isn't it? Maybe, no, maybe not. I can't remember now where I got where I got these from or why. But they're there and they work, so let's not complain. Um that kind of helps. We don't really have a vertical one, do we? Not really. Let's do that one and maybe this one. There. I'm not going to worry about changing any colours in here because I've got the grey there and that can all stay that, I think. Um... Not sure how far I'm into the recording, but I think we'll leave it. I think we'll worry about curtains and stuff in here. We'll let um the uh, new owners deal with it. We do need to put a proper back door on though. For some reason, wants it to go here. There we go. All right, quick recap. So we come in. Go to the left, which is our our little boy's Chelsea Football Club room. Flick the lights on. So a few players on this side. Team logo. A few other team photos on this side. This little blue Chelsea bear. His TV, so you can watch the the boys in bed. Come across to the other side. Parents bedroom. We got a TV in there as well. It's a pretty basic, but still pretty good, I think. Then, yep, come through here. We've got our lounge room on the left, little dining area here, and kitchen on the right. It's a pretty decent sized kitchen. And then through here is the hidden bathroom, which is his and hers sink, shower, bath, toilet, and um, washing machine, all the sort of stuff in here that we need. And then, of course, our um, garage outside, which is empty, it's got nothing in it. Why is it a home cinema? It's a bloody kitchen, jackass. Um, anyway, let's go out. Let's auction her off and um, see what sort of money we get. The house has a five rooms, 105 square meters. We brought it for 82,000. So we'll see what we can get. 144. Chang Choi, 145. 150. For the Johnson family, 151. Two more bathrooms. Okay, Raphael Urko, it's gonna 155. The Jantart family, 156. And Veronica Lipston, 158656. 
Let's negotiate offer for another. Let's go 6,000. Don't think she'll say no. Beautiful. Done. So 75,000 we made out of that. Which is pretty, pretty good. Uh, furniture brought 14, sold 10,000. So yeah, that's pretty good. Righto guys, if you enjoyed this one, as always, smash that like button, leave a comment, let me know what you think of the design, what you would have done differently, how you would have set the house out if you had your own sort of design, and um, if you enjoyed it or not. And don't forget to let us know if you've got any other ideas for houses. I've still got um, Emily Barkman wants a girly house. M Newworth wants a paleontologist house, which has been there for a long time. I just haven't got around to doing it yet. Uh, Casey's also wants a basketball team. Um... NFL team and a baseball team, I think he asked for. Um, Dothael has asked for a handicapped house, which is going to be difficult um, to do because we've got no mods or anything in the game, but we'll be able to sort of just make the the rooms wider and more um, bigger rooms and more room around the furniture and stuff sort of thing for a handicapped house. Uh, Victorian style house and a, a seriously disturbed house, which... It's going to be very interesting when, if and when I do that one. Um, Emma Sandbrook has asked for a kid's play area, so we can do like another family home with a kid's play area there. Um, Andrew Moore has asked for a wrestling house or the Undertaker's house, but um, I think with that one, I might do like a wrestling fanatic's house, not actually just the Undertaker's house. It'd be easier to do like all pictures of all the wrestlers and stuff and just have somebody who's actually absolutely crazy just about um, wrestling and stuff, so... That'll be the way to go. I think that's too big, isn't it? It is. Um, yeah, that'll be the way to go. And Rogan Little has requested recently for a four bedroom with two and a half baths and um, kitchen with a kitchen island and modern, like modern throughout. So we can do that as well. So we've got a fair few designs there. There's um, probably 12 or 15 designs there. So. So um, if you've got any more, let me know in the comment section. And um, hopefully you guys enjoyed this one. It's been Brito. Thanks for watching. We'll see you again soon.